ಹರಿವು ಸಾಡಿದ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಓಂ ಸಮಸ್ತ ಜನ ಕಲ್ಯಾಣೆ ನಿರತ ಕರುಣಾಮಯ ನಮಿ ಚಿನ್ಮಯ ದೇವಂ ಸದ್ಗುರು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿದ್ವರ ವಸುದೇವ ಸುತ ದೇವಂ ಕಂಸಚಾನೋರಮರ್ದನ ದೇವಕಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ವಂದೇ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಅಮೇವ ಮಾತಾ ಚ ಪಿತತ್ವಮೇವ ಅಮೇವ ಬಂಧುಶ್ಚ ಸಕತ್ವಮೇವ ತ್ವಮೇವ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ದ್ರವಿಡಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸರ್ವ ಮಮದೇವ ದೇವ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸರ್ವ ಗುರುದೇವ ದೇವ ಹರಿ ಓಂ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಆರ್ ವೆರಿ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಆರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೆತ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಬ್ವಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ಅ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಲಿವಿಂಗ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಕೆನ್ ಆಸ್ ದಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ವಿ ಸಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಮಹಾಭಾರತ್ ಯಕ್ಷ ಪ್ರಶ್ನಸ್ ದಿ ಯಕ್ಷ ಆಸ್ ಧರ್ಮರಾಜ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ವಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ಅವರ್ ವಂಡರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿ ಯಕ್ಷ ದಿ ಧರ್ಮರಾಜ್ ಯುಧಿಷ್ಠರ ರಿಪ್ಲೈಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಸಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಮಿನಿಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಓವರ್ ದಿ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಸಮ್ ಬೇಬಿ ಇಸ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಟೈಮ್ ವಿ ಸಿ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಡೈಯಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೀಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪನಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಟೈಮ್ ಯೆಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿಬಡಿ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ಪರ್ಮನೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ರಿಯಲ್ ವಂಡರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ದೇ ವಾಂಟ್ ಅಕ್ಯುಲೇಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೈನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೈನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೈನ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ಅಕ್ಯುಮುಲೇಷನ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಲಿವ್ ದೇರ್ ಪರ್ಮನೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ವಿತ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ವಂಡರ್ಸ್ and so life and death is continuously happening all the time this happens in the in the uh, thousands of years ago it happens now and so on it happens continuously krishna makes in fact a statement jatasya hi dhruvo mrutyuhu dhruvan janma mrutasya cha so he in fact gave a recycle process that which is born has to die and that which dies also again be born again so it is a continuous recycle life goes on and the question itself is that is you know, people say i don't believe in god i don't believe in this and they themselves don't know what life is and what exactly is life even doctor cannot tell and all a, all a doctor can tell you is whether somebody is alive or not by its expressions whether he is breathing whether he is responding to the stimulus or not but they say he is alive otherwise if he is not responding anything he says he is almost dead that's exactly what people conclude so but what exactly is life and we do not know and in the proverb we is we call it he is dead and gone that's a statement is mar gaya in hindi or the interview was achi poi nado so what means means he is dead and gone that means he left the body that's exactly what krishna says is you are crying where there is no reason for you to cry the fellow i never born jatasya hi dhruva mutchi ho so whatever is born has to die so there is no point in crying for that that's going to happen inevitably and what is going to born i also will be born again in some form so this is a continuous life cycle according to the vedanta if whether you believe whether is born again or not but at least he is going to die you know and uh, he may extend the life by doing all sorts of things afterwards it will die deteriorate because the the body deteriorates automatically slowly if not 100 years it may be 110 and you may see here this is the longest living person in the world you will see on google somewhere so what exactly is life we do not know what exactly is death we do not know but we know is alive or we know is dead and all our problems is this is mine he is mine and uh, i am this and he is this and he is my relative i depend on him and so on all this all the depends on what on the body only body who is now acting when the body when the dead people start crying and that's what krishna starts gita gita upanishad says this is essentially that there is never a time i was not there never a time you are not there natte vaham jatu nasam natvam nimi dinadipa nacayo navavishyamaha sarvoye tatparam so there was no time i was not there never a time you are not there never a time all the kings so why are you crying and necessarily asochyan anva sochatvam prakne and you are crying there is no reason for you to cry because it is a recycle all the time 
So Bhishma in the Bhishma body may die, but not the Bhishma as soul. So what exactly happens in the death? In the 15th chapter of Gita, Krishna describes what exactly. It is the subtle body that is enlivening the gross body. That's what life is. And life lives means the subtle body taking all that that is the mind and intellect along with the vasanas, the impressions, subtle impressions in the mind. It goes to next level. Why it lives? Because the body is no more conducive to exhaust next set of vasanas or all set of vasanas which cannot be postponed. So therefore it has to find an environment conducive to exhaust those vasanas. It has to find environment and also particular body required in order to exhaust. So we already discussed is anatomical evolution what Darwin says is different from a spiritual evolution. So the mind and intellect which is called subtle body leaves the body, gross body, the matter which is made of carbohydrates, minerals and all that which cannot do anything without the subtle body. So when it leaves then the gross body suffers and in fact it becomes stinky in no time and in the US and all that police will come to make sure the body is removed from the place quickly. So the um, wife and everybody says the they're all over mine, 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 but even the Bhaya Bibhuti Tasmin Koi on the dead body, nobody wants to touch it, even the wife also. So therefore the death itself is separation, so it's not the body that will lie, it is the subtle material, that is subtle body, the mind and intellect package that leaves and when it packages, it collects the mind, intellect, vasanas and the pranas in a subtle form, all that package leaves the body and where does it go? It travels to environment conducive to exhaust next set of vasanas and in order to exhaust next set of vasanas, it needs a body and there it exhausts finds a, a yoni or, or a butt in a loka, in a, in a field where it can exhaust set of asanas. That exactly is life cycle goes on. So how do you end this cycle? You cannot end the cycle unless I realize that I am not the body, my intellect. Then, says, then I am, I am free. Body, my intellect, then there is no one to occupy like a dead letter office. So what happened? Body goes back into the, into the earth that which came by food, sustained by wood, becomes a food for others. Mind becomes a part of the, the Hiranyagarbha and the intellect part becomes a part of the Ishvara. And that exactly happens when you realize it. That is the real death and until then it's only recycling. With that we stop. Om Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamadachati Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnami Vasishyate Om Shanti 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 Hari Om Sri Guru